Right, so we're going to do the pile foundation here. Okay, so looking at our 3D model of it. So it's for um, a site with, with bed, bed subsoil. Okay, so what we'll do first of all is you'll be drilling for your reinforced pile. Okay, which has a diameter of 300. Okay, then on top of a pile, you're sitting on your ring beam. Okay, that's 600 wide by 350 high. Okay, same depth again as the width of your wall. Okay, then once you have your your pile in and your ring beam, very similar to a strip foundation then. Okay, coming up your four block work again for your DPC. Okay, coming up three blocks and your 150 block and come across with your red arm barrier. Okay, then from your fourth, from your DPC work back down. Okay, so you have your 150 mil hard core. 100 mil insulation, and then your red arm barrier binding hardcore. Then your finished detail, then on top, tunnel glue flooring with 30 mil insulation between the, the um, your hardcore fill or your subfloor fill here. 30 mil insulation, stop the cold bridge in there. Uh, 100 mil insulation hugging the inside leaf. So we get cracking on our pile foundation. Okay, so it's a scale of 1 is to 10, and so just do a little sketch inside your page or in the sketch box if you have one, and it's just handy so you don't forget components. Okay, so look at my sketch here. You know, I have my 300mm diameter pile here, then my ring beam, and then my 350 walls sitting on top, hardcore, um, 100mm insulation, um, your binding, subfloor insulation between the inner leaf. Your subfloor, DPC, concrete infill, delivery stability. So I'm going to start off with my ring beam first of all. Okay, which is 600 by 350 high. Okay. So 600, so I have a 300 diameter to go inside, so come in 150, okay, then 300 and you should have 150 left over. So this is for my pile. Okay, and I'm going to put like a figure eight symbol at the bottom to represent that it's a curved surface, that's a cylinder surface, cylindrical surface. Okay. So we need to reinforce that with some rebar. Okay, with some steel. And steel up into the ring beam. And steel. Okay, so my wall is 350. Okay, so I'm going to get my center point. And I'm going to come out 175 either side. 175 here, and then I can come out 350. Okay, so 12.5 and 12.5. 300, yeah. And 175. Yeah. Okay, that's my inner leaf, my outer leaf. Okay, come in 100 mil, 100 mil. You should have 150 mil cabin in there. Okay, 
Okay, so I'm going to put in my black work, 215. And a 1 mil bed, 215, 1 mil bed of mortar. 215, 1 mil bed of mortar. 215, 1 mil bed. 215, 1 mil bed. 15. Right. So, block off the release. Okay, so same as our strip foundation. Come up your four blocks. One, two, three, four. And find your DPC. Okay. So then, it's easier to work back the way it is. Okay, so that's the height of the subfloor. So it's 150 mil. Okay. Then 100 mil insulation. Okay. 30 mil insulation in here. And the inside of the inner leaf. Okay. And. barrier three blocks high on the outer leaf comes across the cavity comes up 150 mil comes across the inner leaf and comes down in on the original insulation okay. that is a red arm barrier okay this 40 mil blinding, binding and under that. Let's just send sitting on top of our hardcore fit. Okay, so let's do a few seconds here. 30 mil insulation. Okay, and two concrete symbols for our subfloor here. Yeah, so under our, our binding, we have 150 mil of hair core and then another 150 hair core. Okay. So just grab them off from the ring beam. 60 degrees to the hits. Okay, so then in our cavity down here, we have a concrete infill, give it that bit of stability, like it's in our, in our strip foundation. Okay, so it just ties everything together here, our inner and outer leaf. Okay, concrete infill. We have our 100 mil insulation, hitting our inside wall.
Okay. Um, to keep in the insulation, you have your wall tie. Sitting on the bed of mortar here and continue to the inner leaf. And we have our finished floor. Okay, the tongue and groove floor. Internal render. 12 mil, external 18 mil. Five mil floor. Tongue and groove. Hundred mil boards. And we have our scrapbook. board. Soil backfill. Okay, so that is our pile foundation finished. Okay, 300 diameter here. Now it comes up into a 600 by 350 beam, ring beam. Get the steel tied in together in your 350 mil wall. Okay, 100 mil outer leaf, 150 insulation, 100 mil inner leaf. Come up your four blocks, put in your DPC. Okay, work back down. 150 mil subfloor, 100 mil insulation, 30 mil insulation between the inner leaf and the subfloor, and your radio insulation here. Um, your DPM or your brad on barrier comes across your cavity to your third block in the outer leaf, comes up 150, comes across, and comes down on your insulation. 40 mil binding sitting on top of your hardcore, concrete infill, and 100 mil insulation sitting on the inside wall. Okay, once you get your pile and your ring beam it's same as a strip foundation coming up okay so fill in your table of contents label everything and in some information here so that was scale one is to ten okay